hello everyone welcome back again to my kitchen in today's video we are making our delicious lasagna so today we are making yasu lasagna and vegetable lasagna and everything we need is ready we have everything some cream fresh some lasagna fish some queso or that cheese depends on how you call it and we are using two type of cheese in this for this lasagna this is yeah we have many cheese because we are making two type of lasagna we need cheese for that and also we have spinach for the spinach lasagna and the tow fish is also for the spinach lasagna and also this is our lasagna plate okay our lasagna and also the mice meat we are using cow meat for this cow meat we are not using chicken so in a pot in a very hot pot you add a little bit of oil not too much you know the meat will bring out its own oil then you add in your sliced onion we are using white onion you fry this and let the uh, onion or the onion translucent let it re release its own flavor <laughs> then in another pot me i'm using pan i had in some water let it boil then you had in your lasagna plate okay you first of all pre-cook the lasagna plate if that makes sense so in a separate bowl you had in your lasagna fish and tomato paste okay lasagna fish is like everything you need for lasagna they, they make it inside the the paper okay everything is there you don't need more salt more pepper this is just lasagna fish everything is there and this is how it looks and here is the kind of tomato paste i use this here you can get this in river then you mix the lasagna fish and the tomato paste together okay like this until you get this consistency okay <laughs> you mix it together like this and now it's ready it's time to add it inside our meat guys remember this meat is already cooked very cooked we were eating it i ate it don't put it in the raw meat let the meat cook very well okay you can add salt a little bit of salt to the meat not too much so we had in our our butter you had it inside it and give this a nice stir, okay yeah like this right now you cannot see too much of hoya in on top of this stew is a stew and this stew you can also use it for pasta spaghetti any kind of pasta it's just like um you know um how do they call it this uh, pasta okay if i remember later so right now our stew is cooked and ready okay uh -huh, spaghetti bognizer the stew is just like bognizer sauce the only difference is that we do not use a uh, bognizer feast we use a uh, lasagna feast that is just the difference you can use it for spaghetti any kind of pasta so our stew is ready okay so you had the stew in any baking pan you tend to use then you had the lasagna on top <laughs> you had the stew you had the lasagna so we make like four step of it four step we had stew you had the lasagna had the stew had the lasagna so we we'll make it four step like this it's not difficult it's very very easy okay so after adding the stew and the lasagna and you get four step so the next thing to do now is to add your cream fresh and this cream fresh you can get it in any supermarket we get ours in Lidl and Reve okay and this is how it looks it's written the cream fresh this is the one you will have before adding the cheese so you add it on top of the lasagna okay then you spread it together and now you can now add your cheese to it 
look at that is that not beautiful please guys don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel again please drop your own comments in the comment section subscribe to my channel share my video thank you so much for your love and your support i so much appreciate and now our lasagna is ready we just preheat the oven at 170 and let it sit there for like 25 minutes and you have to put an eye on the lasagna okay if you look at it where well, you can see the different kind of cheese that i said and yeah now our lasagna is ready perfectly baked and perfectly ready please don't forget to like share and subscribe and don't forget to watch the second of the video how i make the spinach lasagna very delicious and tastes nice and so so tasty see you guys in the next video bye